Hey everyone, I'm back with a little bit of an update. Um, there's been quite a few requests on YouTube to see the status of the pin setter and what's been going on with it. And while the pit is not completely done, I do have it operated enough to show you where I'm at right now. We're not too far away from having it done, but uh, I figured I'd do a little update because of uh, some limited time. I'm not sure how quickly I'm going to be able to get to completing it. So at least again, like I say, we'll show you where we are. First of all, I'm doing a quick walk around. Uh, as you can see, I've gone to a pinwheel design, and there's also what would be a cross conveyor on a Brunswick machine here. This operates a little differently. On my cross conveyor, you can see I have this paddle here, and what happens is it actually brings the pin up sideways like so. And then these little arms right here actually flip the pin around into the uh, chute, which I'll show you here briefly. Um, down in the pinwheel, which is actually also the ball lift wheel, I have one of the pin stations here. And what that does is the pins slide in, and then this paddle can move up and down. It's spring-loaded. Right now it's being held in the up position by this cam rod here. And as it comes up, the cam rod disappears. And this will close. We'll kind of show you how that works. And there you go. It's captured the pin now. So what will happen is it comes up to the top of the chute, or I'm sorry, of the uh, pinwheel. It's going to be kind of hard to see here. I'll do what I can to show you. But it will come up here, and there's another cam here at the top. It hits the pinwheel or the pin uh, holder, and releases the pin. It's then held in place by these two arms here, and it, it sits there. So what will go on now, so I'm going to turn this on real quick, and let you see it pick the pin up, and then distribute it into the chutes. Here comes the rod, or the uh, arm, I mean, and there you go. So that's working there. And now I'm going to try and show you the ball return. I'm going to drop the ball in here. There you go. It's been picked up by the arm there. And it comes up and feeds around. So the pinwheel is designed to separate the pins from the ball. It does everything um, in the one wheel. And to get the ball back there, I have the cushion, which raises and lowers based on this motor right here. Uh, kind of like a Brunswick machine. Brunswick does it obviously a little different than what I'm doing it. but. Uh, for all intent and purposes, it looks like it's going to work pretty well. Uh, I've been doing some testing, and uh, that's why I decided to do this video. Everything's looking okay. So hopefully in the next uh, two, three weeks, I can get this all buttoned up. And then uh, we can bring you back with another video and let you see the whole thing in operation uh, kind of working automatically. So until then, have a good one.